Hello. Thank you for joining us. We're still in Philippians 4. And it says, Rejoice in the Lord always. I, again, I say, rejoice. So we've talked about different things. I want to talk about something a little different today. I want to talk about rejoicing in our prayer life. Rejoicing in our prayer life. When we are praying to the Lord, sometimes we have a long list of needs and an even longer list of wants. But today I want us, while we're talking about what I want, what I need, I want us to stop and just rejoice. Because we have a God that we can actually commune with that controls the entire world. He may not do what we want, how we want it. And he may do, some things may happen because of humanity and, and, and the decisions and the free will of humanity. And sometimes we want to blame God for that, which he's, it's humanity's free will that, pre, that makes these things or allows these things to happen. But I want us to, in our prayer life, Rejoice. While we're talking to the Lord about what's going on, rejoice. While we're asking the Lord to come and show us the way, rejoice. When we're talking about our wants and our needs, rejoice. When we're asking him to deliver us, rejoice. In our prayer life, let us rejoice in the Lord. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time.